Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, I am doing a motherhood Q&A. As you guys know, I've had my baby boy over a year ago. His name is Keon, and I have learned along the way, I want to say. And um, so without further ado, let's get into this Q&A. There are 20 questions, and so this video might be a little lengthy, but hopefully guys like it enough to watch it and would like to learn my experience that I've had with being a new mom um, and let's just you know get started let's just do that. so the first question is how old were you when you had your first child I was 21 um, I'm actually surprised I kind of made it that far cuz girl um, the second question is, when is his birthday? His birthday is April 13th. He was born in 2017. Crazy enough, that day was actually Friday the 13th. So, it was kind of like, damn, you know? <laughs> How did you feel? When I first found out, I felt like overwhelmed because I was working at retail. And, um, man, I was really overwhelmed, I was overwhelmed, but then again, I kind of, like, I kind of knew it, like, I, I knew I was pregnant because I started feeling, like, sick and stuff, like, I was like, dude, I feel like I'm pregnant, and then, like, crazy enough, my coworker, she went and bought me a pregnancy test, and the next day I took it, and it was, like, one of those Dollar Tree, you know? pregnancy test and long and behold I was pregnant. who did you tell first when I first found out I was pregnant the first person I told was my mom and his father we were together at the time and so I was excited my mom was not so much excited <laughs> it was kind of fucking funny like <laughs> how many pounds did you gain I gained 35 pounds or close to 40 maybe 35 to 40 pounds um what did you crave girl every day I ate pizza like no fucking lie I can get my baby daddy and my mom in this video right now well not my baby daddy because he doesn't live here but my mom for real she will tell you I had pizza maybe every day like literally every day <laughs> um so i craved pizza my favorite ice cream i craved which is banana pudding ice cream did you want to know the gender i did want to know my gender just because like yo i'm not like the other girls like oh let's keep it a secret gender reveal like no like this pregnancy I feel like just because I don't have friends, so I know, like, I'm not going to have, like, a big-ass party or anything like that. I'm super antisocial. So, um, this pregnancy, like, I was just, like, super just, like, let's get it over with. Like, kind of like that. Mm -hmm. Did I have any complications with the pregnancy? I didn't. The only thing I got when I was pregnant, dude, what, like, this was, like, the easiest pregnancy and I haven't been pregnant before but um it was super easy um the only complication I may have had was I got gestational diabetes um so I had to like do like this pinching stuff which I didn't do because I don't fucking pinch myself with I'm not no needles are not my friend so I'm not gonna pinch myself I just fucking can't just can't so I had that and um that was pretty much it. I didn't really have any, you know, complications. Thank God. How much did he weigh? He weighed 5 pounds and 7 ounces. And he was 19 inches long. I remember that part. If I didn't say this right, I'll have the right weight and stuff here, but I'm pretty sure 5 pounds and seven ounces and 19 inches long was he early late or on time 
my baby was actually early. We got induced a week early. Um, I guess just because like gestational diabetes, you have to get induced. So my doctor scheduled me a week early to get induced, and yeah, that is the fucking worst. Like I recommend you just try to wait it out till your water breaks, because having them go in and break your water is the worst. Like I was over it. Did my kid have any health issues? No, he did not have any health issues. Only thing is he had, um, damn, what is that called when they're like yellow? I forgot what that, that's called. He had that a little bit, but that was over like after the month. I forgot, what is that called? I don't even know. Like, I'll put it on a screen if I ever find it. <laughs> Favorite part of being a mom? Definitely having a connection with a person that no one else will ever have with them. Um, and just being able to watch them grow and see them do new things that they've never done before. And definitely my favorite part has to be like just his smile, his laugh, like watching him play, watching his person, you know, like who are you kind of thing. <laughs> um, is it easier being a mom or a dad? Clearly, I don't know how it is to be a dad, but I feel like moms have it way worse. Like, we do everything. We nurse them. We, like, burp them. We, we do all of that. And I feel like the dads can, like, you know, sleep a little bit later. Um, you know, don't have as much task as the moms do with our newborns or our babies, period. I just feel like period moms are like, you know, we're like Wonder Women. Like we have to do everything. Do you have any advice for anyone who is about to have their first child? <sighs> My advice to you is you'll be okay. Um, enjoy the ride. Enjoy it document it however you document your things and just like really be in the moment have a schedule you need a freaking schedule like as of yesterday you should have made your schedule like you need a schedule because if you don't have a schedule then like it just shows you off track especially if you're especially sorry if you're a working mom um you need a schedule and you need to make sure like you know you take care of you as well as your baby did you always think you'd have kids absolutely I'm not gonna lie when I was like a teenager with my first love we actually tried to have a baby um, but you know God has his ways and it didn't work out um, so I did always think I would have a kid I always knew I would be a young mom just because I love babies and like I've always just dreamt of being a mom and like just taking care of a baby and you know giving it the life I've never had. What is the biggest surprise of motherhood? The biggest surprise of motherhood I've ever experienced is my son when he's away from me I'm like literally lost like I don't know what to do I just I don't know like I'm attached the attachment to the uh, this human is just un it's unspeakable like it's just you're so attached to this little person and like it's just so fun like enjoy it do you miss life without a kid you know I actually thought about this a couple times um, and you know at moments I do like you know I can't just leave when I want to. I can't just, you know, do things I used to do. But at the same time, no. <laughs> How many children do you have? I just have one. Do you want any more kids? Absolutely. I'm shooting for a girl next. Who's the mom you admire most? Honestly, I feel like every mom is awesome. 
but I really have so much respect for, you know, um, my mom, her ways of, you know, parenting has really, um, I've took some things from her as well as my dad, but mostly her, because I've been around her most of my life, um, but my mom for sure. Um, I love the way Kylie Jenner is handling things. She's my age, and so I really can, like, relate to her, and I kind of do, you know, not look at her for, like, inspir well, inspiration, yes, but, like, not support, but, like, I don't know, she just puts me in a better mode, and I don't know. Yeah, so Kylie Jenner's a good mom right now. I love to follow her and her baby. Um, all the Kardashians, honestly. This is a Kardashian channel. I love the Kardashians. So if you don't like the Kardashians, honey, go. Bye. So I love Tammy Hambro. Uh, I love her. And like how she's just such a fit mom. And she takes care of herself as well as her babies. Um, who else do I love? Like, Jada. Love her. Honestly, all moms are awesome, and I feel like we all could look to each other for something. So, I will never knock another mom, but those are the moms that I follow. Um, and if you're looking for any mommy inspirations, definitely check them out. And, yeah. That's it guys that is my video I hope you enjoyed my Q&A if you're a mom go ahead and do this tag I will try to leave the questions down below so you guys can do it but that's a lot <laughs> it's a lot to ask me um so just you know write down the questions as you watch this video I'm <laughs> just kidding god like, everyone just clicked off just now. Like, bye, bitch. <laughs> if you haven't subscribed to my channel, make sure you do that, obviously. And, um, notification bell, por favor. And, um, yeah. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Love this video. Fuck with this video. If you do, give it a thumbs up. And I will see you on my next one. Bye.